Time for a big game breakdown. Before we do that, betonline.ag wants to pay for your Mayweather-McGregor pay-per-view. $100 value, obviously. You can just simply retweet this message to enter. Must have a BetOnline account to qualify. It goes on daily through day of the fight next Saturday. Let's start with the Cardinals and the Red Sox. Red Sox $1.37 at home, 9.5 the total. It's Lynn against Rodriguez. Red Sox have opened up a four and a half game lead over the Yankees. Now Price, who's been on the DL, Pedroia just goes on the DL, but they're playing good ball and they're getting great pitching. You know about Sale, Pomerantz is having a great year. Porcello has been good the last few starts and Rodriguez pitched well last time out. Yeah, I mean, let's not underestimate the Dustin Pedroia injury. You know, he, the guy doesn't have the power that he once did. He's got a 378 on base percentage. That's his highest since 2011. He's number two in defensive war, according to Fangrass. Dustin Pedroia matters. But the one thing we've seen is that Eduardo Nunez <laughs> has been able to step in for him. He's got a hot bat right now. He's got a question marks on defense uh, at the position. Of course, at third base, with Rafael Devers now uh, playing third, this has been an offensive problem for them. Both of these guys have produced big time of late. Look at the graphic. Nunez and Devers, you know, we're talking about a 647 and 677 slugging percentage. Two guys who are crushing the baseball and helping Boston make up for the loss of Dustin Pedroia right now. Of course, that Red Sox team, they're hitting again. They pounded out 10 runs last night, the second time in their last four ball games. You got Rodriguez, who's only 24, showing signs of becoming a complete pitcher with the ERA under four, the FIP under four, and 9.9 .9 strikeouts per nine. Plenty of upside if he can throw strikes. And it's a wild race in the Central. St. Louis still a game and a half behind the Cubs. Milwaukee a game and a half behind the Cubs as well. And Lance Lynn has been the same, appears to be the same pitcher. Uh, you look at this graphic, the last few years anyways. In 2012, he was 18 and 7 with a 3.78. This year's 10 and 6 with a 3.12. And then you see 2015 and 2014. But a deeper dive, you see the career low in strikeout percentage, career high in walks. And the ground ball rate is almost a career low as well, as we've talked about many times on this show. That's a recipe for disaster. And the advanced metrics read a little bit different as well. His ERA is 3.12. It's like Gio Gonzalez, part two, right, who pitched well last night too. But the ERA, 3.12. The fielding independent pitching is 4.83. The XFIP, 4.68. And the skill interactive ERA is 4.67. Just like Gio, Teddy. Yeah, in a sense, I mean, there's been a number of pitchers this year. Jason Vargas for Kansas City was a guy right. who really outperformed to the advanced metric. The markets went against him. He's come back to earth over the back half of the campaign as someone that really stands out in that regard. Urban Santana in Minnesota, another guy whose advanced metrics say the correction is coming. The market's consistently against him. And at least we've seen some of that uh, from Santana. Well, <laughs> the markets are saying and the advanced metrics numbers are saying Expect the correction from Lance Lynn, even though his overall numbers, very comparable to his career numbers. When you have a career, career low strikeout rate, a career high walk rate, and almost a career low ground ball rate, there are problems lurking on the horizon. One good thing for Lance Lynn, of course, is that, you know, he's got that St. Louis offense behind him. The cards, uh, they're clicking as well offensively. 71 scored, 71 runs scored over the last nine ball games. They've scored six or more seven times during that span, even though the bats have gotten a little bit cooler here in Fenway. Hey, guys, for the full video, go to sbrpicks.com. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to our channel. Now we've put a lot of work into producing all these free videos, so please help us out and keep all our content free for you forever by simply liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Now not to mention a visit to our industry leading website will warm the hearts of all our SBR employees, especially myself. Now the links are over there to the left, uh, so do check those out. Thanks for watching.